You see, the usual queue witnessed on a normal day at uh, breakfast and food joints was missing uh, in some parts of Accra this morning. Our reporter Joseph Armstrong joins us live from a popular food joint in Accra. That's at Debra specifically to give us some more details. Armstrong, what's happening there? We are currently at the Champion uh, Restaurant here at Adabraka, one of the popular food joints. And uh, earlier, we went to the ministries to find out how people are actually observing this prayer and fasting day as declared, as declared by the president. And we realized that the normal queue, long queues that are observed, or is observed during, uh, how do you call it, breakfast, was missing today as most people deserted a uh, public joint or breakfast joint to uh, observe the fasting and prayer day. Here at the Champion Restaurant, the situation is not different. As you can see, we have so much food here and I'm told that on the normal day, this food you see here should have been gone by now, but as it stands now, they still have so much food that uh, they have here, and I'm told this because people are really observing the national uh, fasting and prayer day. Let me talk to one of the madams here. Madam, no, come on, me, 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 Fasting, I can be in faith fasting. Why, dear Shum, champion, take it by this side. One year, if I'm a machine, a yako inside pony, may beg Jamie. It will mean I can fast in any one day. Okay, so that is the madam here at the Champion Restaurant, and then she tells me that, of course, people are really observing the National Fasting and Prayer Day, and I'm moving in quickly to the uh, food joint where they are serving customers, and I want to find out from them how uh, they are faring, because, of course, not everybody is really observing. Uh, inside here at Champion, we still have some few people who are eating. Well, this is the crowd here. There are not so many because on the normal day, the whole place actually gets full. Let me try and see if I can get some few people to talk to and find out if they indeed observe the uh, fasting and prayer day. Okay, so you don't talk to me. Let me talk to people. Boss, how are you? Were you able to observe the fasting at least for even an hour or day? Okay, so you wouldn't talk to me. I'll talk to people, boss. Today is National Prayers and Fasting Day. Did you at least said a prayer to Ghana. To go and buy say and go for boy. No, and fast with me, baby. Oh, I fast in the Miami. Who are time and who are time being? Oh, may I say, before I know about this, no. I got them 12 months. I feel a bit of the energy. I feel a bit of the energy. Okay, it's a year from six up to 12. And you have a touch on Eddie. Okay, so this guy tells me that he has been, he fasted from 6 a.m. and that immediately at 12 p.m. he decided to break. Let me see if I can get some few people to talk to. Boss, let's talk. Were you able to observe the fasting? Did you fast today? Yeah, uh, I observed the fasting from 6 a.m. to 12 p.m. Mm. So I've come to find something to eat. Mm. But ideally, I want to break fasting. You are expected to take some soft drink like tea or something. Uh, but this place, uh, there's fufu, there's banku and things. Is that what you choose to break the fasting with? Yes, it doesn't matter. Okay, you can, fine. Yeah. So, but what did you tell God during your uh, fasting? You know, yeah, uh, we're giving, uh, as uh, directed, mm -hmm. some prayer topics were given for us to pray on it. So I did exactly that. Mm. You did exactly that. Let me talk to a few more people and then hand over to you in the studio. Boss, did you observe today's uh, fasting and prayers day? Well, at the office, my colleagues were saying the government has ordered that everybody should pray and also fast. But I think some people are doing it, but not everybody mm -hmm. is doing it. Did, did you do it? Well, I'm out to buy food, so not yet. So you are here to start your fasting? Yeah. So, uh, 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 to buy food. Okay. So uh, exactly that is the point. And uh, well, not everybody observe the fasting and prayer day, but I must confess that from morning till now, we've been roaming the street of Accra, and we know that so many people indeed really recognize the 
fasting and prayers day as declared by the president of the republic of ghana so we pray that god listen to the many people who decide to put their stomach down to observe this day and we ask that this day of coronavirus will be a thing of the past soon joseph armstrong tv3 over to you in the studio joseph thank you